This is the approach to the jump, and this is the first step of the five steps of jumping. This is where the horse starts to gather himself up, he stretches his neck out, and this is where the rider is preparing for the next stage of the jump. All right, so then it looks like the next stride is going to be the takeoff. So you see that her leg is well underneath her. She's starting to stand up in the stirrups with her seat over the palm of the saddle. The next stage of the jump is the takeoff part of the jump. This is the, where the horse shortens up their neck and coils up their hind legs to push themselves over the jump. If you look at this part, this part, you can see the horse has placed his hind legs underneath him so that he can push himself over top of the jump. And the horses, you see that they, there's lots of flexion in the hip and the stifle and the hocks and the pasterns. Lots of power there to push the horse over the jump. Let's look at the next phase of the jump, which is the flight of the jump. We've done the approach, we've done the takeoff, now let's do the flight of the jump. This is the flight of the jump when the horse is, has, is in the air. Now let's look at the next phase of the jump. We've done the approach, we've done the takeoff, we've done the flight. The fourth one is the landing. I'm just sliding the cursor along the video. So here's the landing of the jump. Now, the fifth and final phase, that's hard to say, the fifth and final phase of the jump sequence is the recovery stride, and that's a stride after landing. Let's take a look and see what happens in that now stride. We're zoom along to the recovery. There's the recovery. The horse has got his hind legs on, on the ground, and she's going away, and she's still really forward. If you have any questions, send me an email, thistleridge at hotmail.com. My name's Laura Kellen May, and thanks so much. Remember to subscribe and like this video so that YouTube knows that people like it.